Good morning, Spaghetti Vlog. How are you? Uh, today is going to be a chill day because it's Sunday here in the McGilly house. The boys are playing and Keely's just been to Lidl's and I'm getting ready to start my new job tomorrow. So follow us today. On our a relaxing Sunday. <laughs> You want me to open these for you? Yeah, I'll pop it up, pop it up, pop it up, and it up. Yes! Party rings. Party rings. Hey, go play ball. Hey, go So I'm just making chicken curry. Um, we've got two onions in there at the minute. I've got 500 grams of diced chicken. You can see my eyes crying because of the bloody onions. Oh my god. Um, we're going to put some frozen veg in there as well, just a mixture of, of curry really, so check it out. Okay, so as you have seen by the title of this video, I'm going to be doing a bath time tutorial for two children. Um, obviously using Mason and Stanley as a demonstration. Now I understand that you might not all have two kids but you can still use this tutorial for one child. Now, you can do this any way you want, but this is simply just the way we do it in the McGilly bathtub. So, please enjoy. So obviously the first thing we're gonna be doing is run the bath to a medium temperature, not too cold, not too hot, just right. And then you wanna undress both children and pop them in the bath, like so. Keely's ready? Stanley's nearly ready? So once they're both in the bath, you let them play for about, I don't know, three minutes. Let them get used to the temperature, let them feel the water and the bubbles and everything. And then what you want to do is get a wet flannel and wash off their faces to start with. After you've washed both of their faces, what you want to do is get some shampoo ready in your hands. Just squeeze a little bit onto your hands and then rub it into your hands. Uh, lather it a little bit and then place on baby's head. Well, after you've done, you've lathered the shampoo onto baby's head. You want to get a large mug or a cup and fill it with water and brush it back over the head so it gets out of their eyes. I'll show you now it's done. Once you've done that, what you want to do is to clean all of their bodies off under the armpits, under the bum crack, under everything and get them clean basically. And then after that, we take them out and we put them onto the towels and we take them into the bedroom. So, first thing you want to do is get them dry. So just start with a dab dry, just a pat, pat, pat. Dry his hair. Dry his armpits. Dry everything. And once everything's dry, you open up the towel fully and you put towel compounder all over the body. Isn't that right, Stanley? <laughs> then you want to rub it all in. Rub it all the towel compounder into all the crevices and cracks. Once the nappy is nearly on, you're ready to continue the mission with his clothes. Very good. 
vest underneath your pyjamas to keep you warm. So I'm just putting a vest on now. Which is very easy to put on. It's got three buttons and nothing else. After you've got the vest on, you want to put the pyjama top on. Which is just a long sleeve jumper called Mummy's Little Monster. Then over the head, both arms in. Pajama bottoms. And socks. And now we have a baby that is ready for bed. So to finish the day off, we are having a hot chocolate with cream and marshmallows. We will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.